I am Anil Kumar. In this video, we will learn how to solve the linear trigonometric equation 2 tan x minus 5 equal to 0, where x is greater than or equal to 0 and less than 2 pi. We are working in radians, right? So let's rewrite the question, which is 2 tan x minus 5 equal to 0. Let's solve for tan x. That means isolate tan x. So we can take 5 to the other side. So we get 2 tan x equal to 5 divided by 2 gives us tan x equals to 5 by 2 or you can say 2.5, right? Now we need to find x. How many values are we expecting? Tan x equals to 2.5. In this domain 0 to 2 pi, in this domain 0 to 2 pi, we know that tan is positive in these two coordinates, correct? First and third. You could know this from the cast rule, right? C A S T, right? So tan is positive in these two coordinates. So you're expecting two solutions to this. Let me just draw draw a line like this. I don't know what the angle is, but this angle is one of them. Since it is in coordinate one, we also refer this to be the acute angle alpha. We can now find this acute angle alpha. The other angle, this is also alpha, directly opposite. The other value of x will be pi plus alpha. So we are looking for two values. One is alpha. The other one is pi plus alpha. These two values are within 0 to 2 pi and are the solutions for this given equation. So let's use the calculator. So what were, what are we looking for? We are looking for tan alpha equals to 2.5 or alpha equals to tan inverse of 2.5 right so let's use the calculator it should be set in radians shift tan inverse 2.5 equals 2 so we get a value which is 1.19 right so that is the value of alpha so one of the solutions we see is alpha itself so we can say x is equals to 1.19 the other value, so there are two solutions. The other value is pi plus alpha. So we, the other value is pi plus 1.19. So this is approximate value. Let's add pi to 1.19 to get the other value. Plus pi equals 2. So what we get here is 4.33. So 4.33. So there are two answers. And these answers are, let me write them clearly. 1.19 radians and 4.33 radians, right? So these are the two solutions for the given equation. I'm Manil Kumar. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Feel free to post questions. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.